Hi, I'm Adam Burrell, Barry Young's Makeup Ambassador, and one of the best ways to learn about makeup and to get inspiration is by looking at the red carpet, where some of the biggest stars have makeup done by the best makeup artists. At the Grammys this year, Beyonce looked amazing as usual, with a really soft grey smoky eye and a deep red lip, so that's the look that I'm going to do now. I'm going to start by just lightly defining the eyebrows using the brow kit. So in this kit you've got a light brown wax, which is great for filling in your brows as well as grooming the brow hairs. It's a bit of a lighter colour, so if you want it a heavier colour, then you can use the brown shadow that's also in there. I'm just lightly making small hair strokes through the brow. And bringing it down to fine in the end. So I'm just mixing the colours in the palette to make the perfect colour. And that's what's good about this palette is that you can customise what colour, so it's great for many hair colours. I'm just lightly filling in at the front but focusing mostly on the arch and the tip. Beyonce had a really soft, smoky eye. So I'm going to start by using the eyeshadow pencil number four as a base. It's a very similar colour to what Beyonce was wearing. So you're just smoking this really far over the lid really quite close to the brow, but not quite all the way. And at the inner corners, if you take it right away to your nose, and look to the brow, and blend it softly all over the lid. And then over the top of that, I'm going to use this dark taupey colour, which is number five. And then I'm going to press this number five eyeshadow over the top. And this is a nice dark taupey colour that's just going to stick to that base. I'm blending that right through the crease, all the way. That is super blended. So we're just taking this all over the lid, up through the crease, and blending out the edges so that it's super smoky. I'm now going to take the same eyeshadow pencil, I'm just going to run this all along the bottom lash line. Joining it up to the top. And then with the little brush, just blend that out. And then inside the eye, I'm going to use bold black waterproof eyeliner. I'm taking this all along the waterline. Lightly blend it into the eyeshadow pencil that's already underneath. Using the same eyeshadow that I used on the top, just going to run that along the bottom lash line. So don't be scared to take this quite low. That's how Beyonce wore it. Now using the Wink black marker pen for eyes, I'm going to define the lash line. Beyonce wasn't wearing a lot of eyeliner, but her lash line was definitely defined. So I'm just going to run this along, pressing it into the roots of the lashes, and little strokes all the way to the end. You can just angle it on its side and press it into the lashes rather than going in like that. It's a lot easier. 
I'm going to finish with lots of the new Las Vegas mascara. And this one's in an intense black and it has fibres so it makes your lashes a lot longer without looking too clumpy. So just make sure that you cover every single lash from corner to corner, getting right in at the root to really bulk up and add a lot of volume to your lashes. Now as the eyes are quite intense and the lips also, I'm just going to use a bit of the natural dazzle bronzer on the cheeks. So I'm just taking a little bit up and over the brow, on the temples. I'm also just going to take a little bit of the bronzer through the socket. And this just really softens that smoky eye. I'm taking it right into the corner the brow and then down through the socket and just a little bit along the bottom too. And finally for the lips, Beyonce wore this amazing brownie red colour. I'm going to start with lip liner number one and I'm going to colour in the whole lips with this. So using a lip liner first makes your lipstick last so much longer. That means you can get a really defined edge. Just make sure that you get it right into the corner so it joins the bottom. And on top of that, I'm going to use the Ultra Moisturising Lip Paint in number 162 which is an amazing deep red colour. And when you mix this with the brown lip liner, you're going to get that perfect Beyonce shade. So I always like to use a brush to apply the lipstick purely for a more precise finish. And that's your finished Beyoncé red carpet look.